Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to the Shermichael Singleton Show. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that notification bell to get updates of our future uploads. Confederate Heritage Month. What, what is that? What is this Confederate Heritage Month? Well, in the state of Mississippi, their governor, Tate Reeves, declared April Confederate Heritage Month, which is a month to celebrate the heritage of the Confederacy. You heard me right. How does that make any sense? The hell if I know. But Governor Tate Reeves decided that the Confederacy is something that should be celebrated. And, you know, I, I'm looking at just some of the issues that the state of Mississippi uh, has to deal with. Now, Reeves said that he issued a Confederate Heritage Month proclamation, quote, in the same manner and fashion that the five governors that came before me, Republicans and Democrats alike, for over 30 years have done. And we did it again this year. Didn't think this was, was the year to stop doing it. Now, four governors before Reeves, not five, issued Confederate Heritage Month proclamations. By state law, uh, Mississippi also has a Confederate Heritage Day in April, which is a holiday for state employees. And so I'm not going to put all of the blame on... Reeves, Governor Reeves, uh, but Governor Reeves certainly could say, you know, this is ridiculous. We don't need to continue to do to do this. Now, according to Mississippi's uh, succession ordinance in 1861, it states, quote, our position is thoroughly identified with the institution of slavery, the greatest material interests in the world. Now, former Governor Ray Mavis, a Democrat who held office from 1988 to 1992, did not issue a Confederate Heritage Month proclamation, and he criticized Reeves for doing so. He said, quote, his Confederate Heritage Month proclamation sounds like he's endorsing critical race theory, learn from the past, etc." Mavis wrote Tuesday on Twitter. He continued by saying, heritage of Confederacy is treason and slavery. We should learn from those things, just maybe not in the way he imagines and by he he's talking about governor tate reeves and again four governors have done this before reeves i'm not going to put all the blame on reeves but this is ridiculous man the confederacy committed treason against the united states government i'm not other governors have done it i think it was idiotic for other governors to have done it i'm a conservative there are a lot of issues that the state of mississippi needs to really deal with let me let me give you guys just an example of, of some of the issues that the state of mississippi uh, currently has to deal with. Mississippi has persisting problems such as failing schools, high unemployment, poverty, low wages, lack of health care, hunger, infant mortality, and teen pregnancy. Uh, these are some of the problems that affect the state, particularly in rural, mostly white areas, and minority, mostly black areas. Mississippi also has the highest poverty levels among all states. Uh, it ranks 35th in the nation for K-12 through achievement. So in my opinion, Mississippi needs less celebration, more jobs, and more reading, writing, math, and science. That should be the focus of the state, which ranks at the very bottom uh, of some of the most critical things that are necessary for your citizenry in your state to perform well and be competitive in the national and global job market. Let me know what you think about this issue, though. This is Sure Michael. You're watching the Sure Michael Singleton Show. Take care, and thanks for watching.